G'day guys, Sci-Fi back again with another, I was going to say action figure review, but my ass. No, we are talking about the Rise of Skywalker. Um, spoilers and all that sort of stuff. Yeah, I've gone to see it. My friend Ollie has seen it too. My son, who was supposed to be here, he's got a sick dog. Everyone's got sick dogs. What's going on here? Anyway, so, yeah, thanks for joining in. Thank you, Ollie, for coming over. Um, the Rise of Skywalker. Um, I like this video. I like this movie. It was great. You can just spit it out, man. I, I'd need to make a couple <coughs> of things clear. Simon needs to give me about two minutes to speak. I'm not <coughs> anti Star Wars, and I'm not anti Rise of Skywalker. I actually think, well, in pick comparison, pick it to fucking bits. You watch. It's okay. He's allowed. We're to. here to critique. Exactly. I'm a lifelong fan. Go I deserve it. to have him for it. I'm not here to bag it. I actually think in comparison to number eight, that piece of shit that Ryan deliberately tried to sabotage. Um, it is a fantastic movie. Absolutely fantastic. I have certain issues with it, but I've heard, had certain issues with all three of them right from the beginning where I told you mm. directors aren't necessarily writers. And I think given that I have some videography background and and uh, moving making ability, I editing my own work, adding a score, yeah, subtitles, the whole lot. You just can't have a director unless it's his child from the beginning, like Lucas. Unless he's Steven Spielberg or George. Lucas. Yeah, unless it's your your child to begin with. Yeah, you can't have a director do the whole lot because. Directors aren't fucking writers, and you can't pass it off from movie to movie to movie. That was just a stupid Spielberg, idea. George Lucas, they, they had their vision, not a vision given to them by a movie company like Disney. Yeah, only a Disney. Still, well, Disney... <laughs> okay, what did you like best? I've got a couple of things I like best. Oh, I liked... The best thing I liked were the Star Destroyers coming out of the water. That was fucking tough. And some idiot behind me was going, how are they in the water? Aren't they going to sink? I'm like, they're not sinking if they're coming out of the water. You fucking idiot. Keep eating your fucking chips. Hey now, that is great. Fucking knob jockeys. That is great fucking special effects. Mate, how did I manage to pull that off? Anyway. But, um, yeah, also, at, you know, yeah, all the ships coming out of the water, brilliant. Story-wise, uh, I'm going to say, oh, I honestly thought Chewbacca was going to be dead. thought he was going to be toast, but he's not. Okay. My favourite, favourite, <laughs> my favourite things were seeing a lot of new Force abilities, though, ah. though some of them I would have to question. Um, my favourite thing... The Force Heal. That's the, weird. My favourite thing was that it was a fast-moving, or fast-paced movie. Yeah, very As quick. opposed to that, that snail-crawl piece of shit number eight. The other thing that I like best about the movie is that technically you could watch seven and then nine, and eight is completely irrelevant. Now, having, having done some film editing and promotional work on video... <laughs> I think a lot of the times, when something's made, it's made. You just, you know, well, you can't satisfy everyone. Let it live. I don't think that's the case in episode eight. I think Ryan Johnson should actually be taken to the gas chamber for deliberately, oh. deliberately fucking up a perfectly good intro that he had. Um, for trying to bring things into a movie that no one was interested in. Um, and for not following... Do you like my t-shirt? It's Adidas and Star Wars. Yes. Sorry, man. Keep going. Anyway, so I, li <laughs> I liked the fact that you don't have to watch episode eight ever. Yeah, you can pretty much bypass that fucker. Mm. Yeah. All right, force abilities. The healing thing. That's new. Well, not for video games. I think nah. it's a handy thing in video games. In I'm video not sure how handy shit. it was in the movie. I still need to play fucking... Still need to get along with um, 
We've had floor ceiling for a long time, especially mm. in video games, so that, that works well. And yeah. I like seeing it, but to me, and I'm just throwing it out there, it's not a critique, <laughs> but where was it when Qui-Gon got, got stabbed? Where was it when Anakin yeah, was burning? Well, yeah, he got fucking, he was stabbed through and through. Where was when it when... Fucking Kylo Ren gets thrown through and suddenly, oh, we'll save you. Where was it when Kylo Ren, uh, you know, uh, Liam sorry. Liam Neeson, fucking he's a man. Yeah, th there's a bunch of people that could have been force healed, you know, like Anakin's mum. Yeah. They're just, nothing. Man. So I have a couple of other questions and it, it's it's mild critiquing. One. Go for it. Why did we see Harrison Ford? That was cool. I went, oh, it was, it was nice. But, but he's not a fucking Jedi. He's not. The force is not with him. Even layers. If I died to, if I died yesterday, you wouldn't see me going. Oh, what are you up to, man? Fucking behave yourself. <sighs> I'd be dead, dead. dead Even dead, having dead. humped Leia does not doesn't make him no. part of the fucking part of the gang. No. no. So even a pussy Why didn't we see? Why did it? not we see Anakin Skywalker? Why I expected we? that at the end. All these fucking Jedi going behind. That's him. what Whoa. I thought. I thought we'd see a whole. Where's all of them? You know, Kit Fisto, Plo Koon, fucking. And we got nothing. Nothing. We got a couple of we voices. Got, we got a we got a smuggler from the other end of the galaxy. We ended up bagging Carrie Fish, Art, ah, Princess Leia. Fucking, that would have been some good sex. Oh. And then suddenly, boom, he becomes fucking a uh, vision. So I Where's think the rest of them? giving credit to where it's due, JJ did a phenomenal, also, also, phenomenal um, job. Also, there's, there's, no, um, there's no barbers no. in the afterworld because Skywalker seemed to have his beard a little bit longer and his hair looked a bit longer too. Yeah, I can't he, remember. Yeah, uh, he just looked a bit dishevelled. More dishevelled than what he was. I'm like, oh, come on, man. Trim it up. One, another thing I guess I didn't like so much, even though it was fast-paced, it was fast-paced to try and explain retarded stuff that was in Episode 8. Again, we can bypass right. Episode 8, but here we have Leia that was too busy humping to finish her apprenticeship as a Jedi, who had then... Some children. Who then... Had eight kids. Yeah. One. One. Who then was more powerful, apparently, than any Jedi we've met before to train Rey the way she did and to suck herself back at from outer space. That was bizarre. That was weird. Mm. The, the yeah. last gripe I have is this. It should never have been called the Rise of Skywalker because, one, there are no Skywalkers at Rose, and two, though all those people saying this is now the end of the Skywalker, you know, saga... Bringing Palpatine back into it, and there was no need, JJ. That's a nice little. I understand that, mm. you know, you're trying to make money, and I understand that. Wasn't a perfect circle. It was shit because Wasn't we now we now circle. know it's, it's, it's no still good. A, Don't get me fucking wrong. Don't get me wrong. It was, perf it was great. It's now no longer a Skywalker story. It is actually a Palpatine story. This all, is where it all opens up to new stuff, oh dear. new things. There was nothing wrong with bringing Snoke back. There was nothing wrong with introducing Plagueis. I don't know where JJ's head was at. Like, he had all that information in Plagueis. Plagueis, yeah, he's involved. He's he had all this information, and he used The none Emperor's of great. I've got to admit, the Emperor was good in the new movie. He freaked the fuck out of me. He really did. And then all the Emperor clones in the background. Now, I can say this. I went to see it with my, <coughs> my two kids, my, my nine-year-old boy and my six-year-old girl. Here's what happened. My nine-year-old boy took one look at Palpatine and curled over and went to sleep and said, no, I'm not watching anymore. He was fucking Whereas my daughter, age six, watched the Wait. whole thing, stepped out of it and said, that was better than Frozen 2. Your when, daughter is a fucking... fucking and she, his daughter, honestly, is the fucking... She's manic. She's like us. So when, when, when we got home, she said, I wish we had it on DVD, then we could watch it again. Your son is shit's weak, mate. I tell you, oh, son is shit's weak. Anyway, Your daughter was, is fucking awesome. It was a she good. She knows what's going on. It was a good movie. I it don't, is. It's don't, good. Don't think they should have brought Palpatine back. No, I'm glad they did. And ran it all over. It just ran it back. That cockhead you think was going to die and should have died. And I'm glad I knew how the fuck Snoke died. That was the big thing of episode eight that really got me. Was episode well, who's this guy? Why does he exist? 
and suddenly he's dead. He was no one. He was no one. He was a fucking clone spastic. He was some clone thing Maybe. that thought himself to be... <laughs> he had a bit of lightning come out of his hands and he thought himself to be fucking hot shit. In his gold bathrobe. And his bathrobe, his little slippers. And that, that was gay too. That was just another episode eight blunder. He was frightening at first, but then when he died, I'm like, oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Come on. Hmm. Unreal. Unreal. So it was good to see that so um, Captain knew... Phasma did <coughs> survive all that. Some she people in Star Wars it. actually fucking die. Yeah. Zori Bliss was pretty cool. Just a little... Wasn't much there. Zori Bliss, little gold girl. I think... Pulled her... Pulled her Glasses down and went I like, below. I like Poe's role. He had a much more extended yes, role. Yes, so did Finn. I like that. Well, and I like the fact that that Asian girl was cut out of yeah. it, and it was more Why? more Finn and Ray again. Rose had some. Rose had some good spot. Good spots. Shit. Oh fuck off. Ray and Rose Ray and good. Finn. They were a good couple. Uh, I tell you what, they're going to be bringing out some bloody um, dark Ray figures. Yeah. <laughs> That looked pretty cool. I'm bringing that out pretty soon. Yeah. So, um, and now imagine this in today's society, Mr. Trump gets impeached. Oh God, here we go. Yeah. I don't like politics on my videos, but anyway, we'll just continue. I hate on. politics too. But Big snay on the politics page. Hey, Star Wars has plenty of politics through it. They do. Now, Trump gets impeached. Clinton's found out by having a stain on a girl's dress. Everyone's dirty washing comes out sooner or later. I yet thought we were Star talking about the rise of Skywalker. Yet, yet Star Wars wants us to believe that Palpatine, while in power, had a child. No one knew <coughs> anything about it. Had a granddaughter. No one knew anything about it. He jizzed on someone's clothing. Yeah, see? That, he jizzed on someone's the clothing. The galaxy is not that big. Someone must not have known. <laughs> someone must have known. Yeah, he and has, just, has no he one He just somewhere and made something. He made sprogs and fucking which made Ray. And at the end of the his. day, has no one heard of a galactic franger? What's going on? They don't have him, I guess. This is a force is with me. Uh, Unlimited power! Fucking there's hammered still, the shit out of him. There's still also anal sex and oral sex. Oh my god. But whatever. No, that's not. What minutes we at? Oh God! Don't don't be a dick. Let's. We're let's, only twelve minutes in. I know, but we're f you're talking about that shit. We Shut were debating up. whether we rise should... of Skywalker, we rise were, of Skywalker, we rise of Skywalker. Fuck your frangers and anal sex. We were debating shit. whether we should do this as an off-topic or on Sci-Fi's channel. No, now, you do it on mine. It's okay. Now I think Sci-Fi's channel is good, and all of those of you that are <sighs> too precious and can't stand. A couple of bits of swearing or drinking. No, no, no. I've I've been I've been offered this. Someone, um, only one Kenobi, Nick, has said, "Please do this. Give me a video with cigs and beer and language." You got it all. And We've sex. Got it all and no, there's no sex. Involved. Well, apparently there was in Star Wars a lot. Just we got <coughs> to see none of it. You're not supposed to. I'm not supposed to seem so, to take toilet breaks so either. Nick, so I, I know you shit? did a review of the movie. I never watched it just because I didn't want to find out what, seen what happened. I'm going to see it after this. Um, just so you're aware, I don't know what you've got in your review. I'm not bagging it. I love the movie. It was f fantastic. Not movie of the year by any stretch. But that was because of all the damages they did. They frantically <laughs> were trying to make up for it and cover it over. They unfucked what was fucking up. Yeah. yeah. They did it. They did it. And it's all good. I loved it. And then you can see the got the, the ships from the rebels in the background. <clears throat> Hello, what have we here? You got to see Lando did Calrissian. You, did you find that was his greatest his greatest vocab was him laughing rather than saying anything? Yeah. How many times yeah. did he laugh? Wah, wah, wah. Oh. <laughs> He laughs like, like Jimmy Carr, just about. Yeah. The cleverest thing that <coughs> they could think of making him do. But he was fucking <coughs> cool, man. He was cool. Lando was cool. And I'm pretty sure, I guarantee, they're going to make all these figures now because they said, oh, we can't make the figures, 80% of the figures, because it'll give away what happens. So now, back to my video and 
action figure channel, action figures, go ahead, Hasbro, go right ahead, because the video, the, the movie's out, it's all good. Man, I want to see that bloody six-foot aphid thing with um that uh, the other guy, for the rebel pilot. You know, I want to see um <coughs> see the old Lando figure. I want to see. You know, you're going to get a C-3PO with red eyes, don't you? I've already got one, man. Oh, okay. I've already got it. What with a little Babu Frick guy in the back? Probably. I honestly thought C-3PO was going to be a fucking destructive. Nasty robot. His role, his role was huge in the film. It was big. I'm glad. <laughs> Anthony Daniels, in the last one, he said, my my um part in episode eight was me being a bit of a trinket, just standing there doing nothing. But this one, he had a big role. Mm, huge. He does. He had a larger role than, than Luke Skywalker did in the last yeah, two movies. Yeah, yeah. Bloody hell. Good on you, Anthony. Good on you, mate. Yeah, yeah, here. Yeah. So, oh, To the Rise of Skywalker, which wasn't really a Skywalker, it was the rise of someone, a Palpatine offspring, who magically had more power than all the Skywalkers put together. Absolutely. <laughs> it was good. What else can I say? Man, I've got to say... What did you think about Ben always switching... Ben Solo. <sighs> it kind of drove me a little bit nuts. Yes. Over all three <clears throat> movies. Like, I'm good, I'm bad, I'm good, I'm bad. I'm smashing the helmet and putting it back together. I didn't mind it. It was good. It was like some guy going, really, I'm going to go down that dark path. I have to pick up because I found some people who actually like me or love me. I liked it. Be in it the, Leo and Solo. I liked it in the beginning where he's... he's yeah. And he kills he found, his fucking father. I liked it in the beginning where he found Palpatine and he just goes, I'm going to fucking kill you. I don't like you either. Yeah, exactly. Because Palpatine is just the most disliked person. I thought it was brilliant. In the whole Star Wars It's kind of reminded me of the Kylo Ren we had that, that would lose his <coughs> shit and start slashing bits. Oh, the whole... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. That was cool. But no, we got more to a... It was a... You guys need to fucking settle... No, I need to sort myself out. And he did sort himself out in the end. And Another thing I liked... Remember how we were watching some of the previous the ads before the movie came out? Yeah. And I told you there's a bunch of people running along the Star Destroyer. If that's a true, if that oh, happens, the horses things. Yeah. yeah if that's yeah. true, that's shit. Anyway, so I'm glad they they explained they that. They weren't really in well. the vacuum of space. It's okay, yeah. everyone. Well, after Leia, you <coughs> just never knew what was going to happen. You know. Uh, no, it's know. not in the vacuum of space. It's in atmosphere. The so, horses are breathing. The humans and whatever is breathing. Well, Jenna, I like Jenna. She was cool. She had a bit of space in there. Yeah, she I was cool. Jenna. Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, some people just fucking need to grow up. And one of the this this take in the movie, finish the movie and go. Oh, good. It's finally done and dusted. It is. I'm looking forward it's to the no next more. next three. Fuck, I'm not. Twenty 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 two. What the guys from Game of Thrones that. J.B. Weiss or whatever his name is. I'm yeah. hoping they'll make it more like Knights oh. of the Old Republic because oh, if anything... If they, make a game of, if they make a Knights of the Old Republic, that'll be great. Hmm. Better still make a fucking game of it. Jesus. One of the best Star Wars storylines <coughs> I saw was Knights of the Old Republic one. <coughs> that was brilliant. Oh, oh that... You, you, you can put these 10-minute little Old Republic... No, 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 the Xbox one, the first yeah, one. Yeah, you can put all them together into a 30-minute video. Someone's done That's it. That's cool. It's got 30-odd million views, and yeah. And it had some really cool, um, uh, what do you call them, Sith Lords as well. It had yeah. some really cool Sith yeah, Lords. Yeah, not Revan and all that. And it also had a dude who had a hat, a wide-brimmed hat like um, Cad Bane, a human. I'll give him to him for a price. Now, that's another thing. That's coming up soon, very soon. Episode Season 7 of... Uh, oh, no. Not Clone yeah, Wars. Yeah, Season 7 oh, of the Clone shit. Wars. Fuck some no. other fuckers. Here we go. Season 6 was great. Man, you didn't know how the hell this Order 66 came through. You didn't know how the Most logical minds could figure that out for themselves. Really? Yeah. Order 66. If I said to you... Captain Ollie, Order 66. 
Mate, that is the beauty of a Star Wars movie. It's high tech, right? We have everything except for intergalactic frangers. If you have a clone army, of course you're going to have a fail safe in there where you just say something and all of a sudden they're masturbating, all of a sudden they're turning on each other. This is classic. This is the reason, this is how and why. So, as because a Star they Wars need to fan, explain it because otherwise dickheads didn't. like you go, oh, why the hell are you going to No, they didn't need to explain it. A fan like you mm. and a fan like me that's always known, you know, stormtroopers to be what they were, i.e., not clones, yeah? We had to. We we didn't need an explanation when the switch came. Here's here's the galaxy using robots. Revenge of the Sith. Everyone goes. Why he just said that? Why yeah. do you just say I didn't that? Need, I didn't need an explanation. And there's a, there's a there's a TV show that explains why and how. Who cares? That TV show is shit. Fuck you. I'm willing yeah, to say TV probably show's great. Probably almost as shit as as number eight. But anyway, man. The Clone Wars, I guarantee you, the Clone Wars TV show is great. And the new season is going to come out and it's going to be great. How, how many minutes have we You're got 20 left? minutes in. Wow, and it still hasn't gone all... Okay, we can still talk. <laughs> I don't care. When it starts to get blur, blurry, it means I'm going to turn it off. But it's not. Yeah. That's cool. You're Keep talking. Clear. Keep talking. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So this yeah, is my right. silly camera. Just after 20 minutes, it goes, oh, I'm tired of filming you guys. It's probably because you're holding it and it's heating up. More than likely. I don't know. But still, we'll just talk a little bit more and then that'll be about it. Um, what else? Now I'm looking forward to the new ones. John, uh -huh. John Wick 4 is coming out in 2021. Cyberpunk 2037. Or 2137. That video game looks pretty cool. With... um. Keanu Reeves. That looks cool. There was even talk of a Matrix 4. I'm, I'm hoping not, but anyway. Yeah, yeah. Um, mm. Probably be after. <laughs> that, like that, mm. Yeah, then there's talk about a bunch of Star Wars stuff, like an, like an Obi-Wan Kenobi TV show. That Don't cool. do it. No, it should be cool. I'm happy I'm with that. I'm sick of Disney taking stuff and fucking it up. You saw that. You're taking you, some of you our favourite characters you and messing it over. Uh, the fan one? Yeah, well, whatever. Don't, we good. don't need to know about Obi-Wan. We know about Obi-Wan. Well, we know. He's done everything, hasn't he? Yeah, what, what kind of a TV show is that going to be? Him in the desert know. occasionally checking on little baby Luke. That's exactly what he's going to be doing. Me. And you know, at first no. I thought, nah. Absolutely The not. Mandalorian's cool, cool idea. Mandalorian's fucking tough, man. Obi-Wan, don't fucking do it. Uh, there was talk of another standalone movie, which they said could oh. be like a Knights of the Old Republic. That'd be cool. Yeah. If it's a trilogy, a standalone, I heard don't care. Heard about that. Heard about that. Um, no. Please, no. Yeah, Star Wars is going to keep going. Hopefully with better storylines and directors that are dedicated, not some arsewipe that has it in for Lucas. I don't know. Mate, Ryan Johnson didn't copy enough. Eh? His career needs to be drowned. Well, his be career better. otherwise, when he makes other movies, is pretty good. Right. He shouldn't have made a Star Wars film. Kathleen Kennedy shouldn't should have, have been put those... Fired. Well, she's... I think she's going She to should be it. impeached. Impeached! Impeached! Impeachment! Impeach the bitch. Well, I mean, I remember still... She was, kind of her kinky. and her buddies were wearing those The Forces female t-shirts. Oh, and I wrote a message going, No, it's not. <laughs> There it is. The force is a home. I'm offended. Died. I'm offended. Well, I'm not, but you can't sit there on. <laughs> I'm glad that we got somewhere with webs. Ray and that she wasn't another immaculate conception. That was kind of cool. Yeah. Even even if she was a Palpatine, I always hatch my my bets saying she was Ben's sister, but they separated them because mm. they didn't want them to find out. Personally, I think that would have been a better angle than having her be a Palpatine, but. Whatever. Thank you, kind sir. We're drinking. A little bit. <sighs> hey, Arsh in the Luft. Blow Arsh the froth Luft. off that one. Blow the froth off the couple. Horst. As he would say in his home country. Horst. Horst. Still. Anyways, um... Wow, this video is still running around. Um, all right. 
Um, any Ooh, more shit. about Rise of Skywalker before I switch this thing off? Uh, uh, no. Uh, Knights of Ren. Ah! I what thought... about them? They disappeared pretty quick, didn't quick. they? But I like the I like the fact that we finally got to see them. They weren't given any importance. They didn't need any. No, they it's didn't kind of, need any importance to begin with. I kind mean, of like Captain Phasma. Was she nice was just to cool. Have seen she them. got axed. Yeah. What happens to these guys? They fucking appeared and then suddenly the end, they got axed by. And they got zipped. Yeah. yeah. He said, "Fuck you guys." I'm yeah. kind of weird looking. They look more like something I out like of Mad like Max them. or something. Yeah, you know? I like, like them, man. I want I want every single one of those figures. Sorry. Characters as figures. I don't care. Six inch, three yeah. three quarter inch. I want one. So it was good to see them. I think he he tried desperately. The, the I'm movie, gonna see the movie again. Though. The movie moves so fast. He tried to just yeah. tie off so many loose ends so quickly, and he still did better with the character building than than other people have done. Like I really enjoyed Poe's role, um, Finn's role. Uh, I didn't like, uh, what's that sniveling guy, the, the snitch, what was his name? Oh, oh Hux. him, yeah. Hux? No, Hux, he got killed. Yeah, I'm glad he got killed, he wasn't yeah. much of a character um, because anyway. Because he didn't like, he didn't like fucking Kylo Ren. Yeah, no, I'm glad he got I'm, killed. it's, yeah, I actually liked him. Did you? And, yeah, and the actual guy who killed him, I like him too. He kind of reminded me of a young Adolf Hitler or something. Yeah, because he's all fucking... Anyway. The first order will rise! I'm like, yeah, man, it's fucking catering to his Adolf Hitler. Yeah, um, sort of I like some of the special effects. I'm not sure I like the special effect they use for Palpatine where you see his face cheaply flesh about... He looked a lot fatter. I like the fact he was missing fingers. That looked kind of cool. Yeah, but his face, he looked a lot fatter. I'm, like I'm not sure I understood the he whole... He was well fed. Yeah, of course mm. he had all them syringe drivers and shit around. You fucking had a whole bunch of them. Yeah. I'm not sure I, I understood or or maybe even as a result liked the crowd that we saw yet didn't get to see and he's talking to ancient sis that didn't really oh, exist. Oh, but here's all these little clones yeah, or in the background. Are, we didn't get know. much about that. No, no it was weird. And, and it was like the clones of the emperor. All of a sudden we're doing He's this a clone. R real, yeah, ritualistic mm. stuff where, you know, there has to be a sacrifice. You know, you have to strike me down so that, you know, me and all my cronies Kill can live in you. That'll be that. That'll be that. And yeah. I thought, fuck, that sounded a bit like a Chucky movie, you know, but whatever. Um, again, if we hadn't have used Palpatine or if we had to use Plagueis or something, it would have made a lot more sense. It could have been cooler. Next time, Disney, I'm offering you my services, only charge a mil. He can, yeah, one million. One million for his services. Me, I'll do it for free. Anyways, I'm going to leave it to now. Um, I can't think of anything more to say. I can. I'm not sure if I mentioned Keep it at going, the beginning man. of the let's video. Go. Come on. Let's... The reason we get to have a whinge at Sulk and be really critiqueful is because we are truly lifelong fans. Yeah, I watched my first two Star Wars movies in Germany, yeah, this in another good. language. This is good, yeah. Yeah, and I, I, I instantly fell in love with it. And as I was saying to Simon before we were filming, mm. I still have certain scenes in my head because they're just magic moments and, and a super cool movie. I enjoy collecting figures, and I don't do it as efficiently as Simon or some other people, but I feel like a child in a toy store when I see them. I love all that stuff. It brings about fond memories. So I think I'm, I'm the best person to be able to offer my services or at least critique. I get sick of hearing under 30 year olds going I'm a lifelong fan oh, I loved it fuck the, off the internet the internet life journalists long. I love internet journalists yeah, fuck off love you guys fan. fuck right off internet journalists it's a very discombobulated movie blah blah blah, blah. and then next they got to watch something like Little Women or a Peter Greenway movie which is in black and white about a naked man and a zebra fuck off so this let me, is Star Wars, man. Star Wars. And only certain people should be entitled to have, have a voice. Well, so let me say, everyone, anyone's, everyone's entitled to, to have, have, have their opinion, say. Have an but, opinion. But if you're under, under 30 and you don't know Star Wars like us, your opinion's not important. Shut the fuck up. Ooh, okay. I know. You like that? All right, no. <laughs> no, that's I've okay. Watched, 
I'll let you have that since, on you. But um, this since is... since I've watched the movie, I've watched some reviews of people. Yeah. I See, mean, these are people <coughs> saying I'm a lifelong fan. No, you're not. No, they're not. No, you're not. They're not fucking lifelong. I mean, people. I mean, I, I mean, I've been very good until today. Watched the movie, but then beforehand, of of um, well, everything's a fucking clickbait. Star Wars sucks. Uh, Star Wars sucks. Rise of Skywalker sucks. Rise of Skywalker sucks. I'm like, you're doing that to make people watch your. <laughs> Internet journalism, you know, fuck off, man. Get a fucking real job, you cunts. Yeah, Jesus, collect Star Wars off. figures for fuck's sake. Yeah, get, you know, collect Star Wars figures, man. It's not that hard. I've only got thousands of them and only been doing it since 1977. Fuck off! But so, yeah. So having said that, you know mm. that, that besides... Sorry, 78. Since, you know that since about 2006 I've been doing... Mm. A shitload, both through my business, but also personally, video editing and, and videography. Right. Mm-hmm. My home, my home movies that that run for about an hour to an hour and fifteen yeah, minutes. Yeah, I've seen your videos. Yeah. They alone. Do you know how long it takes to come up with those for for an hour and fifteen minutes? No idea. I reckon solidly, without sleep, without piss breaks, two months of my life. Wow. Every year. So imagine what all these big million imagine dollar these, movies. Hundred and five, hundred and ten million dollar movies yeah. take. So spending someone's uh, going fucking edit, 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 oh, edit, 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 edit. Yeah. <coughs> and this then, is why these guys in the first Star Wars movie back in seventy eight won the Academy Award. Yeah. So I have an appreciation for what they do, it's all good, but it wouldn't have hurt to spend that extra couple of million to have some writers, you know, helping helping out. No. Fuck it. The Rise of Skywalker is a great film. I loved it. Watch it. Watch it. I'm going to watch it again. I watched it with my son, who was meant to be here, but unfortunately he's got a sick dog and was meant to film us doing this. Doesn't matter. Um, you got a sick dog as well? i got a sick dog. Is that a sick dog? Fuck. Um, I'm going to go sit with my wife. This is what we do. I'm nearly finished. My I'm gonna talk into my cigarettes. It's gonna be a long ass fucking yeah. movie. It's like oh. 35 minutes. Who cares? Hey, the focus hasn't fucked off. I tried to do a 20 minute video the other day, and the focus just went bleh. Just died it's in the ass. Because you bored the camera. Hmm? You bored the camera. I must have bored the camera. Anyway, so there we are. Anyways. It does though. It focuses in and out. That's what I do. When, that's what happens when I use my phone as a second camera when I do off topic. Okay. No, this is just yeah, a it's camera. I goes. point, I yes, shoot, I watch. talk. Well. <coughs> Hopefully getting an IG-11 figure up soon from the Mandalorian. That's coming at my postal address. Um, and then there's... Uh, quite a few more figures coming up. Um, what's his name? The big squid-headed looking dude. He's coming up soon. Plo Koon, Bib Fortuna, I think. All these cool looking guys coming up yeah. in the early 2020s. Yeah. There'll be plenty more Star Wars figures to come for a long time. I might not Where's be doing... Where's the figures from episode 7? I'd like to see some figures from episode 7 that <coughs> never Mate, came out. I've done a whole wish list. Anyways, I'm going to pull the phone here. This is us. This is the beer cellar. Dun, 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 dun. There we go. All right, guys. Ollie and myself are out. The Force is with you. Watch Rise of Skywalker. It's fucking fantastic. Yep, this video is not for kids. If it is, if your child happens to watch it, then you're a shit cunt parent. <laughs> See you then. Bye.